Hi everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel, where we dive into the weirdest and most unexpected aspects of American life. Today, we're going on a journey to explore a topic as controversial as it is fascinating. Fasten your seatbelts because we're about to embark on a roller coaster ride through America's 10 most racist towns. Hold on tight as we enter America's 10 most racist towns, where stereotypes break down, history gets weird, and you might be surprised by what we find. And remember, no matter where you're from, understanding our past is the key to a brighter, more united future. Let's get started. Number 10, Stereotown. We start our excursion in Stereotown, where wokeness is, by all accounts, holiday. You might ask why it is just number 10 on our rundown. Since at Stereotown's yearly Conflict of Generalization celebration, occupants amusingly take on the appearance of cartoons of different identities and contend in an occasion, however silly as it could be entertaining. Number 9. Frolicville. Frolicville has solidified its put on our rundown because of its extraordinary, flaring skips around celebration. During this occasion, the residents make the world's biggest huge fire, made all together of consuming generalizations. It's an unconventional method for praising solidarity, and in a real sense, consume with extreme heat, old, biases. The Blazing Skips Around Celebration is an entrancing exhibition where these cliché images burst into flares and blur into the evening. It's a strong visual portrayal of the town's obligation to stifling generalizations, and advancing a feeling of harmony. Number 8. Puzzle Town. Our next objective, Puzzle Town, is distinctly befuddling and is number 8 on our rundown. The town is known for its yearly Conflict of Generalizations celebration, where occupants cleverly take on the appearance of personifications of different nationalities and partake in contests as baffling as a jigsaw puzzle. Puzzle Town's conflict of generalizations occasion is novel to the point that it perplexes pariahs. The contests are intentionally kept puzzling and members embrace the ridiculous, such a lot of that, it turns into a type of parody. It's a way for the town to defy generalizations and show the world that even something really difficult handled with humor and imagination. Onagenthain. Number 7. Nuttown. Our next stop takes us to Nuttown a town that is somewhat nutty most definitely. Nuttown has tracked down a novel method for battling generalizations with the Nut March and comes in at number seven on our rundown. The Nut March is a tomfoolery and insane interpretation of battling generalizations. During this occasion, occupants spruce up in ensembles, addressing different nuts, underscoring the message that it's okay to be somewhat nutty, however, not to pass judgment on others in light of their appearance. It's a pleasant method for advancing acknowledgement and remind everybody that variety ought to be commended. Number 6. Animation Rivulet Animation River is a town that celebrates variety through human expression and gladly holds the sixth spot on our rundown. It has the Generalization Road Workmanship Show, an extraordinary occasion where gifted specialists change generalizations into provocative masterpieces. The Generalization Road Craftsmanship Show is a staggering visual gala where specialists challenge generalizations by changing them into enthralling masterpieces. This city involves imagination as a device to have significant discussions about variety and consideration, and they have prevailed with regards to changing their roads into outdoors displays where generalizations are exposed with each brushstroke. Number 5. Unicornville Unicornville is where they celebrate variety with the Unicorn March, positioning fifth on our rundown. At this yearly occasion, occupants take on the appearance of legendary animals to underline the significance of embracing singularity and praising contrasts. The Unicorn March is a capricious and vivid display that reminds everybody that being unique is okay. By changing themselves into legendary animals, occupants remind us generally that variety is supernatural and praising our disparities can be a really charming encounter. Number 4. Dance Town. In Dance Town, variety becomes the dominant focal point with the Dance of Variety occasion, positioning fourth on our rundown. During this occasion, occupants feature social moves from around the world, 
changing the city into an interesting dance contest, celebrating various rhythms and rhythms. Dance of Variety is a genuine demonstration of the force of dance as an all-inclusive language that rises above borders. The residents meet up to praise their disparities through the wizardry of development, a blissful occasion that genuinely embodies the solidarity tracked down in variety. Number three, Spice Town. Spice Town came in at number three on our rundown, facilitating a blazing stew challenge. In this novel occasion, occupants eat increasingly more stew peppers, sending the message that not the aggravation characterizes an individual, yet the capacity to adapt to the harshness of life. The stew challenge is beer is basically as hot as it sounds, yet it's not just about fiery food. A zesty update individuals can adapt to life's difficulties, regardless of how unpleasant they are. Spice Town shows that with regards to variety, everything no doubt revolves around embracing the intensity and figuring out how to flourish in a universe of various flavors. Number two, Hugsville. Our second place, Hugsville, is a town that encapsulates fellowship with its 24-hour embrace run. In this extensive occasion, occupants embrace the entire day, spreading adoration and energy, and demonstrating that occasionally a basic embrace is sufficient to separate divisions. The 24-hour embraces mission is an endearing occasion that changes the city into one monster embrace, a powerful update that adoration and empathy are all inclusive dialects that can rise above any gap. Hugsville has made an occasion where solidarity is basically as straightforward as a warm embrace. Number one, Diversityville. Diversityville is where solidarity is praised with the yearly Rainbow Opposition March and procured and esteemed in front of the pack on our rundown. At this brilliant occasion, residents paint themselves from head to toe in different varieties to make energetic rainbows and offer anecdotes about solidarity and acknowledgement. The Rainbow Obstruction Walk is a strong festival of solidarity and acknowledgement. Occupants meet up by painting themselves in every one of the shades of the rainbow to remind everybody that variety is lovely. This march is a visual exhibition with an unmistakable message. Variety is strength and embracing. It is the way to a more splendid, more comprehensive future. Yes, there you have it, folks. We took a whirlwind tour of America's 10 most racist towns, a roller coaster of quirkiness and creativity. From Stereotown to Diversityville, we saw how these towns tackled the issue of racism in ways as unique as they were fun. As we end this enlightening journey, let's take with us the idea that fighting racism doesn't always have to be a serious matter. Laughter, creativity, and a dash of absurdity can be the antidotes we need. So let's celebrate the diversity that makes this world fascinating and strive for a more tolerant, an inclusive future. Thank you for joining us on this unforgettable journey. And until next time, stay curious, stay kind, and keep making the world a better, more inclusive place. See you on the next adventure.